Smith wins. Like, please, Lord. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? <laughs> it's, that, was a, that was a nice one. OK. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Oh boy, welcome back everyone. There's probably not a soul on earth who hasn't witnessed this historic television moment. Upon the news hitting the Twitter sphere, however, I noticed a meme had reared its face very consistently in threads. Now rarely do I find a correlation between current events and comic book history, but oddly, it seems like as good a time as any to explain where this now infamous meme began. The shortest answer is that the panel was from an alternate universe story where Batman is convinced that Superman murdered his dad. Allow me to explain. The cover of World's Finest number 153 touts its contents as an imaginary story, rather than the usual totally real stories featured within the book's pages. The story inside is called The Clash of Cape and Cow, and takes place in an alternate universe where Batman's parents were not killed when he was a child so his mother lived long enough to die of unremarked upon natural causes instead. Both Bruce Wayne and Clark Kent are teens now, the latter known as the internationally beloved hero Superboy. Bruce's dad, who is a medical doctor, who's researching an anti-kryptonite serum to help Superboy against his enemies, is suddenly murdered by a prowler on the same day that he was supposed to hand the serum over to Superboy. Bruce manages to catch a glimpse of the killer before they fled through an open window and he comes to some conclusions. Bruce is an orphan but nobody will believe that the great Superboy could commit such a terrible crime without evidence. You can probably guess what happens next. Bruce swears to become the world's greatest detective in order to crack the case of how Superboy definitely killed his dad. Just like in the main universe, Bruce Wayne eventually witnessed the death of the Flying Graysons, adopted Dick as his ward, and trained him to become Robin. The problem is that Dick Grayson is a pretty big fan of Superman, and when he found out that Batman's whole deal is that he wants to ruin Superman's life, well, conflict erupts. For the fairly reasonable suggestion that maybe Batman's jumping to conclusions about Superboy, we get the slap heard around the world. Mm-hmm. So next time you post a meme and you see the dialogue bubbles are regularly different for whatever it suits, this was in fact the reason why it occurred. Not that interesting, but worth mentioning. And well folks, it's been a comic book minute. Like, share, and comment, and subscribe folks. And as usual, we'll see you on the next one.